they're saying, like, there, like Austin said, there can be someone with all the talent in the world, and if they're not consistent, no matter what, who you are, you can outwork that person. I don't care, like, how talented they are. You can always outwork them, um, and that is what consistency brings. Like, consistency is, like, developing constantly. And, I mean, even, like, outside of that, um, when I was done sports, it was like, all right, what's next? Like, all right, focus on education stay consistent with that and where that has taken me into having a career and still being connected with sports and still going like going to school graduating from college you know being consistent and serving um even starting up a podcast being consistent with that like there are so many like sports can translate so easily into your next part of your life and it doesn't have to just end right where you are or when it's over like you can keep continuing working towards something and even if you are in the gym someone that just let's just simply say in the gym if you want the results you got to stay consistent and doing the little things and they all add up that's, that's yeah that's all it's about uh i think a lot of it has to come down to to lifestyle i think that's a good word to use uh like you said a lot of people work hard and a lot of people have the talent already but you know they the difference between me and a lot of these other guys that i was beating is they were only working hard for the three months that we're in season. And mm. I was working hard 12 months twelve months out of the year, every single day. And it's always on my mind. And, I mean, you can attest to this. Like, bro, I missed out on a lot in high school when it comes down to, like, social life and friends. But I chose that. No one no one made me do that. I wanted to do that. And that, But with that came a state title. You know, if I, if I went to a couple parties or if I went to, you know, went down to the beach a couple times with my friends instead of training – who knows? I mean, I very well could have won a state title, but I also very well couldn't have. And, uh, you know, I'm, I think I attest a lot of my success to to the lifestyle. And, you know, I, I eat good. I train good. And, you know, I live the right life and it, it keeps me confident. But that, and I think like how Nairi said, I haven't had the opportunity to translate it into life yet or a quote unquote real life. Like right now, my job is I'm still an athlete, uh, but I have real big entrepreneurial dreams. And, you know, I think it's going to translate really well because it's just that obsessiveness. You know, I'm just obsessed with whatever I'm doing, man. It's all in. There's no there is no just like half in, half out. It's everything. Yeah, good. 